Yeah, check this shit out, right? It's fucking amazing, right? It's like Breath of the Wild shit right here. Yeah, it's like Breath of the Wild, but you don't kill anything. Hey everyone, this is Two Girls with a Quick Look of Yonder the Cloud Catcher Chronicles on New Game 321. Alright, ah, so you get, cool. to, you get to be male or female, and what about th in the body shape, you can like be like that shape or that shape. Oh, so the body shape, you can, you know, be andro, androgynous, or, you know, hourglass shaped, or that shape. It's like, That's my shape. I would I, I wanted I would say there's some people would say these different shapes are masculine or, or feminine but whatever and also you can be chunky or petite huh. do you want to be you want to be like that yeah with the with the broader shoulders yeah you want broader shoulders yeah you know, like that yeah okay also you can change your skin color So much of Let's Here. go somewhere in the middle. That, yeah. No, that's... No? Okay. Are we trying to look like you? No. Oh, okay. One I like is one of the default is blue. Man. Oh, that's so cute. Oh. And, like, throughout the game, you can find different hair shampoo that changes your hair color to, like, pink and stuff. Mm. Let's do this. Yeah. What color eyeballs do you want? You want pink eyes? Yes. White eyes? Do you want pink? Yeah. Okay. I'm playing. Now, one of the great things about this game is that you never kill anything. You don't kill anything. No weapons. No killing. Our dearest child, it broke our hearts when we sent you away. But it was the only way to keep you safe from the darkness that poisoned our land. When the day comes that you seek the truth, trust in the celestial compass to guide you. It will lead you far across the sea, into darkness and into light, but it will always lead you home. So we're an orphan that was sent away. Awesome. Home to Gemia. So it turns out our, our family was just sick of our shit. Yeah. <laughs> this game is super relaxing. Basically, you just go around collecting um, fairies or whatever so that you can black away blackness or something. Black away blackness? Yeah, I don't know. I don't get it. I just think that it's one of the great things. It's an open world exploration game where there are no enemies to hurt you. Oh. Yeah, it's cool. Oh. Jib the sailor! Do you think we'll find people living there? Can't wait to try out exotic new recipes. Oh, do you have a new recipe? Recipe! Recipe! Uh, no. Luff, the sailor, the old salts back home, said we'd never find the island, because there will there always be bad winds. We shall prove them wrong. Ha <laughs> ha, idiot! Captain mm. Pullen. If that compass of yours is right, Jemia should be just behind that bank of fog. Are you ready to finally see the island? Here we go. You didn't let us talk to the guy in the back. It's really getting rough now. <laughs> dun -dun 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 -dun. I'm just waiting for things to happen. Maybe we gotta keep talking. Oh, oh. I was like, wait, what happened? And why am I flying? <laughs> oh, oh no. and that's the end of the game. You died. Hey, I'm not spirits here. Sprite. Sprites here. You and your friends are safe. You will see them again. But first, you have a great task ahead of you. <coughs> <coughs> I am Airy, Airy, Airy. Airy. Oh, Airy, once a proud protector of these lands, I have been waiting for you. Please, may I see your compass? Open compass. Guiding, Guiding light. light. Ooh. 
As I thought, a celestial compass, use it whenever you are lost. It will guide you truly, but for now your path is blocked. My family can help you, but they themselves are lost. Find them, and they will lead you home. Now, Sprites here, <coughs> awaken. Your journey has only begun. Oh no! Where are our friends? Ta -da -da -da. Oh, I don't have any tools yet. I just love this game because it's like a mixture of like Harvest Moon and Exploration. What is it? Oh, oh. oh my god. A human. Can you do the voice? Cause I'm a my human. It's been a long time since I've talked to a human. All of the people who could talk to me have gone away. Wow. <laughs> Please take me with you. I don't want to be alone anymore. Oh my god, that's so dark. So now we have Lumi. We, did, we found a sprite named Lumi. And like, what like, 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 huh? Like illuminate. So you want to pick up stuff with these Ooh. mushrooms. Later, I'll have a hammer that I can smash this stuff with. But look, check this out. Lumi is going to be able... The way out is just past the Merc. It's bad stuff for you humans, though. I'll try to get rid of it, but I am not sure if I can do it alone. So you want to collect Yay! these these sprites who each individually... Ah! Phew, that was hard. I wish I had my brothers and sisters to help me out. Oh. If we work together, I think we can find them. Oh, each, they're so fucking cute. Yeah, each sprite has its own, like, unique look. Yeah, check this shit out, right? It's fucking amazing, right? It's like Breath of the Wild shit right here. Yeah, it's like Breath of the Wild, but you don't kill anything. You just collect fairies and sprites, and you get rid of the muck. And you can... Ooh, there's a village over there. Let's go check it out. You really aren't looking the best. I bet we can find some out there. Remember, if we get lost, you can use your celestial compass. It's useful to map out your travels, too. Mm. Anyway, let's head over to the village. And just check this out. Do you like hearing You're never in voice? danger of being hurt because you have an umbrella. Aww. Nothing bad ever happens. Ever. This game is the most relaxing, most not bad happening game ever. Nothing dies, and also you can get farms throughout the land. Oh my god. And they, and yeah, it's beautiful, right? It's wow. absolutely beautiful and amazing in every single way. And you oh. have, yeah, they follow you around. It's great. Fairmont. Ooh. Hello, traveler. You look like you've been through some hard times. Please come inside. I can offer you some warm food and a soft bed. Yeah, nothing bad happens. The townsfolk warmly welcome you. Yeah, nobody ever goes, the townsfolk fucking hate you. No, there's always... The townsfolk have heard about your reputation and they shun you. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Forever. It's never, it's just Once nice. Once your belly is full and your worries are eased, your head hits the soft pillow and you drift to sleep. God. Yeah, it's oh. the most relaxing there game. There more games like this. I know. There, that's much better. You look ready to face the world again. Just one more thing before you go. Ever since that terrible accident years ago, Merc has been popping up all over the place, making life difficult. Aww. But the people here are friendly, and we love to share what we know. Um. Ask around, and you'll soon have all the skills you need to make your way around in this world. So there's a lot of crafting, and... Oh, I have new clothes! <gasps> I, oh, no, those are our tattered clothes. Oh, here we go. Yay! Oh, these are... Where? See? Mm -hmm. And then where? And, that. and we also have a wig. Ooh, Ooh tousled long hair. Tousled. So you can find different wigs and stuff. Hey, what's up? Wow. Yeah. That it storm capsized your boat. It also destroyed the east docks. Now that's a big problem for us. I like that voice. Thank you. Huh. This is a trade guild, you see. Without the East Docks bringing in goods, we're not in any position to help you out. Oh. Let's see here. Take this mallet and gather some stone from Arena. 
Eight times stone should be plenty to prop the East Docks back up. Mm -hmm. You'll find stone around the grasslands and near cliffs. Once you've got enough, deliver them back to Marina on the beach. You know what's really weird? I listen to a lot of audiobooks now, and I just, I have all these, like, I'm like, oh, if I were to narrate this audiobook, like, this is what I would do for this person's voice and stuff like that. I heard an interesting tip about how when narrator, like a good narrator, they don't try to necessarily make their voice sound higher or lower depending on wh who is speaking. Like if a woman is trying to, trying to do a voice for a man, they don't necessarily make it sound lower, they make it sound more gruff. Like you go for the feeling of who the character is as opposed to like the actual tone. Mm -hmm. And that way it's a lot easier to communicate the voice without sounding like this. You know? Yeah. I like, which is fine. Like we could totally do the high low voice thing for a game like this, but over the course of an entire book, it would be very tiring on the voice and on the ear. So these are traders. There's no currency in the game, but you can trade what you have. So let's say, like that's worth four hundred and sixty-five, whatever. And then I got a backpack. I don't have enough money. I, I got can, a backpack. I can save. So I can sell these pants or something. Oh, and it shows kind of like in relation to each other. Yeah, so it's basically trading. There's no currency. You're trading items for stuff. Oh. Huh? Oh, hi. I heard there was a new face in town, so you want to learn the ways of a mm. trader, eh? Well, it's not all just swapping stuff for other things, you know? A trader has to get creative, too. Oh. Here, go grab me a vine and three times three sticks, and I'll share a trade secret with you. So that's cool, so that in order to get stuff, instead of having to find money, you find, like, things. You got a hammer. Yeah, I forgot how to use it. How do I... Well, maybe that's his box. You yeah, but I forgot how to swing my shit. Oh, yeah, you gotta go... You, you just gotta, gotta run up it, right? to... Yeah, never mind. Ignore me. <laughs> oh, look, there's some muck. Let's see if we, uh... We have enough uh, duties. Clear muck. Merc. Merc? Yeah. To purify the merc, you must use sprites that you <laughs> found. We need one more sprite. So if you see any blue light, let me know. So let's go towards the docks. God, this is the fucking cutest. Make a thing. bundle, seek. We gotta go to the east docks. On the way, we gotta like hit some stones, and then that'll do it. And then also later, you can find a farm, and you can just like keep like fluffy bunnies and cute thingies there. It's really quite wonderful. Here we go. Smash. We got rocks. We got vines. More vines. What's that? Oh my god, is that a little animal? Yeah, it is. Oh, it's a cat. <gasps> yeah, you can you collect cats. Oh. Yeah. Oh no. Oh yeah. Oh there's yeah. No wait. There's, there's some there's some sticks. Yeah, yeah, we want them sticks. Stick. Yeah, we want I sticks. I think there might have been another one. It's okay. There's sticks everywhere. Don't worry. Okay. This is stick. <laughs> okay, okay. No, this vine. Okay. <laughs> So there's nothing stressful in this game whatsoever. Oh, hey, dude, what's up? Uh, hello, so you're the traveler who washed ashore earlier, eh? Well, no wonder you look a little wimpy to me. <laughs> Sly McWilly, Mc, uh, Sly McWiley. That was a McWilly. <laughs> it's important to be strong and healthy. You have to have big muscles like me to cut fodder all day. Uh-huh. Here, yeah, take this sickle and show me what you've got. Show me what you've got! Alright. So when you collect the grass, you can also pick up seeds and stuff. And the seeds you can plant on your farm, or you can plant trees and stuff. And also the fodder um, you use for crafting and stuff. That long grass didn't stand a chance. You're not as whippy as I thought. Like I said, having big muscles is important, but it's important to have a big brain like me, too. Ooh. That way you can get other people to cut your fodder for you. Uh. 
Thanks. He just basically told us he scammed us. Mm -hmm. yeah. Scammed. Oop, stone. Rock. There's a campfire. Yeah, this is where the east docks are. So, I need two more rocks, two more stones. <coughs> Can I oh, smash wait, wait, this thing up? There. All right, now we can fix the docks. And also, you can go fishing. <laughs> hey, lady. Hi. And this goes here, and that goes... Ah, oh, hello there. Oh. Whoa, you've got everything I need to finish up. Show beats me trying to piece it back together with driftwood and crab shells. Huh? It'll be done in a jiffy, and trade will start coming through to Fairmont once again. Oh, yeah, and guess what? And that blue sparkly thing? That's a fairy or whatever. Yay. Come here, fairy. Oh. Being stuck in there was a real drag. Anyway, let's shove off and let me get me stowed in that backpack of yours. I like that in order for me to do sprite voice, I have to be like, ah! and you just talk normally. <laughs> Ooh, black rimmed glasses. Hold oh my on. god, we are gonna be so stylish. Fuck yeah, we are. Check this shit out. Yes. Yeah, girl, check Get it out. It. <coughs> <coughs> <The co coughs> I got too did excited. You, did you see? Oh wait. What? Did you see what it said for the description? The core pillar of hipster fashion. <laughs> so there's a day and night cycle, and um. There's a hill in the distance with like a giant like sky whale that floats around it. A sky whale. Yeah, dude. If a game has sky whales, you know it's good. But there's like this place is so huge and it's just all about exploring and like Oh, here's an animal. Animals. What's this? It's a, a grapple. Duh. Of course. Yeah. What? And you, so, is he running away? Yeah, he's running away because he doesn't know who you are, man. Hey, hey, I'm trying to talk to you. <laughs> and we just gotta run around, go exploring. Oh, grass box! Hey! And you can befriend these dudes by getting the food that they like. And then um, there should be a farm over here. Oh, yeah, here's the farm. But I don't know if I have enough sprites to clear it. Yeah! Yay. Bing. So we can fix up a farm. One merc cleared in the grasslands. Six more to go. Um, how do I clear, how do I fix this? Southfield Farm. Farm closed due to the Merc. Come see me in Fairmont if you can help. Uh, I guess I have to go back to Minnie and be like, hey Minnie, um. I fixed your farm. I fixed your stupid farm. But basically you fix the farm and you can do all kinds of cool stuff, and explore. Yeah, it's just a good, it's just a fun time. What's it, what's over there? Where? Those. Oh, it's just, uh... Oh. Seeds. Interesting. Yeah, you can plant seeds for growing and, and food and stuff. Ooh, blueberry seeds. You can grow that on your farm. Mm -hmm. But it, there's, like, different ecosystems as well. There's a desert. There's, like, a rainforest. And like different towns have really beautiful layouts and stuff. It's just, it's just wonderful. It's just a wonderful time. This is just like, you know, if do you just want to sit and be happy? Yeah. And like know that nothing bad will happen. Exactly. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. So blah blah blah. blah right. Yeah. Yeah. He taught us how to make sticks. Cool. Thanks. Bundle of sticks. Oh yeah.
I want to go clear that muck real quick. Merc. Merc. It's just wonderful. I mean, look. Beautiful. Beautiful. Everywhere you look. Beautiful. And also, um, there's other animals like these fluffy bunny thingies that flop around. Mm. Oh, I can plant seeds here. Hold on. And you want to like, you want to grow like lots of trees and stuff. Mm -hmm. And look, there's a cat right oh, there. Oh, he's like rolling around and shit. Look at it, look at him. I got him. He's happy that I got him. Ooh, iron ore. You discovered hide. We gotta go talk to Minnie, and I'm sure she'll go fix up the farm. Whee. That's the old guy. Huh. Okay, we gotta find Minnie. Ugh, we gotta use her brain. We can't just use a laser that points us where to go. I think, sh shouldn't she have been... Yeah. Oh. I hear you're in need of a roof over your head. Well, you're in luck. Uh. The old farm in the south field was abandoned when the murk appeared. Hmm. If you can clear the murk, you're welcome to the farm. I'd love to see the old place patched up and running again. Guess what, lady? Yeah. I already did it. Take this axe and gather some materials to fix the place up. Huh? The farm is in the south fields through the big tunnel. You can't miss it. <coughs> so we need some wood and sticks and stuff. So we'll go chop down some trees. Sticks and stuff. Hey. People always like to ask, like, what you know, what you do to unwind to like, you know, if you're having like a stressful day or whatever and you want to feel better. And I never know what to say, but this seems like a pretty good game to play. Yeah, you can play it on your PC that I built for you. Yeah. There's nothing bad that can happen. Literally nothing. There's literally nothing bad. It's impossible to have something bad happen. <laughs> no joke. It's just one of the main reasons I love it so much is because you don't have to stress about out about enemies coming to kick your ass. Well, enemies and also like it doesn't look like you have to stress about time either. Nope. Because I get really stressed out when I play games that have to do with like time cycles because it's like, like oh your crops got spoiled oh like everything died because you didn't water it oh my god. You yeah, know? nothing go not. No, you just leave the animals and you come back and they're like here's some food and you're like shh. Wheat. Yeah. Yes. Ah. Oh, ah. hey there. Blah, blah, blah. I'm Dab, hand of repairs, and I know a thing or two about running a farm. You know, look, now that you've cleared the murk, let's roll our sleeves and patch this place up. Ta-da! And guess what? A little guy. There's a guy over here. Uh. Hey, kid! I had a perfectly good thing going here, and you came along and ruined it. Uh. Well, I guess there's no going back to that pigsty now. So let's get a move on, youngster. So this guy, hey, what's up? Congratulations, you have your very own farm. There are a lot of things you can do with a farm. Yee. Here, I'll give you some farm items. Let's get you started by placing a large animal pen. Ah. Once you've crafted the large animal pen, use the big book on your farm to place the pen wherever you like.
There we go. Yes. Da da da. This is so cute. Of course, it's cute. It's but amazing. Put the fire truck in. Yeah. You idiot, do it. God. All right. So, everything's good. Ah. Well done. Now that you've placed a large animal pen, you can begin to adopt large animals. Ah. We can adopt animals. When you're ready, come see me again and I'll teach you how to do that. Hold on, let me plant some, um... Things. Yeah. So we got, what is this? I can plant this, I think. No, I can't. Plant seed. Nope, won't let me. Okay. Now we'll go back to this guy. And he's going to tell us how to tame a dude. Hmm. Groffles are the best. They're those big brown grazing animals you'll find in the fields near ah. here. Besides being big and fluffy, if domesticated, they'll produce groffle milk for us. Hmm. You can befriend animals by feeding them their favorite food. Feed a groffle psyllium seed and it will happily follow you for a hmm. time. Here, I'll show you how to make psyllium seed. And you go out there and bring us back a big fluffy groffle. We gotta make some psyllium seed now. Ugh, oh, we need a stone. Alright. Let's go find some rocks. And then... We gotta get some rocks. Oh, there's maybe you can break that Look, stone. the sun is rising because everything's perfect and wonderful. <laughs> and nothing bad happens in this beautiful world. Oh! Was that a guy in there? Nah, he was just hanging out. Oh. Now we can make psyllium seed and give it to a groffle and they will follow us into our farm. Check this shit out. Now he's like, yo, 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 what's that about? Hey, buddy. What's, uh, uh, you got that psyllium uh, seed that I want? The groffle seems interested. Uh, he loves us now. Uh, That's right. Use your little feet. <laughs> Use your little feet. Yes. Oh my god. Mm. I cannot. Wow. That's a fluffy groffle. Mm. We can now make groffle milk. So check in from time to time and collect the goods we're producing. Mm. I'll be here to look after any animals you adopt. But it's a good idea to put in some food and water to keep it happy. Huh. Don't forget, if you want to build your farm more, you'll need the help of a carpenter. I'm not quite sure how to put food and water in. It, oh. always, it always seems to just be there. So, whatever. Uh. Yep, he's gonna follow us around. Now, uh, return to farm. So I get you guys get the gist of it, but there's also like all kinds of quests you can do. I just wanted to show you the farm, but it's gonna make you go all over the continent, and you gotta like. Wait, you're talking as if we're not gonna play the rest of this game. No, this is not gonna be a full let's play, Stacy. <laughs> but like, let's just walk in a random direction, and you'll see a town over here. And this town, I think, over here is is uh, tailor themed, as in. Um, like clothes. Yeah, and so there's like giant stuff. pieces of yarn and shit over there. Ooh. So we're gonna run over Let's here. Let's go look at it, yeah. And there's just like all different types of ecosystems and animals and stuff. Just to, just happiness. You know? Just good old time. Ah! Nothing bad happens. Ever. Nothing, Nothing bad, bad happens. happens. 
and it's amazing. At worst, it's like, oh no, there's some murk. Like, yeah. <laughs> that's it. So this is the tailoring town. Babinkoff. <coughs> oh wait, no it's not. Yes it is? I don't know. Yeah, it is. Because there's a giant piece of yarn in the yarn middle town. of town. Yarn town. You gotta find like spider silk or moth silk for these people. Oh. It's just a wonderful place to be. Nothing bad happens. <laughs> and you can have pink, pink hair. hair. And everybody is nice. Nobody is ever mad. Nobody's ever disappointed in you for being a horrible daughter. Just <laughs> kidding. No, not. Oh, yeah, and I don't think you get tan leather from like not killing things. It's weird. I don't know. Interesting. You just like get it. I Maybe don't... they shed their skin. Yeah. You I'm know? just gonna run around now so you guys can just like. See that it's a wonderful place. Ta -da! Even when it's storming, you're like, yeah, it's good though. Oh, here it is. That's a fabbit. A fabbit. Look at him. Like, oh, let's just make everything as cute as fucking possible. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. He looks like like Kirby or something. Okay, so when you farm these, they produce fluff. <laughs> Oh. And you can also go fishing in this beautiful water. I'm just running around now. So anyway... And we automatically have a light. There's no nasties that come out in the dark. I know, there's no stressful monsters who are like... Do you remember when we first started playing Final Fantasy XV and we were like, Oh yeah, like Look, it's asleep! <laughs> and we were like, oh, everything is like like so pretty and like nice and then they were like yeah just don't go out after dark and we were like and you were like what could be so bad and we go out at night and this like le monster that was like twice or like three times our level came and just absolutely pounded us into the ground yeah and we had to abandon the car was not a good time oh here's a stinky place It's just a stinky place to be. It's like farting. It's farting. Did you hear it? Yep. Farty fan. No stinky flowers allowed. Yeah, this is a fart marsh. Wow. Exactly. It's a wonderful place. It even has fart... Farty fan bog. You, can you hear that? Yeah, I heard the... <laughs> the, the beautiful farts <laughs> of the fart marsh. Ah, listen okay, to that majestic sound. I can't. Oh. I don't have enough moon flowers. I have to bring nice smelling moonflowers and then the sprite will get mad because it's like, I will, I love being stinky, you dick, dingus. Don't judge me. I like to smell like farts. Leave me alone. I'm in a fart marsh. Wow. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, look, there's some other town. So anyway, that's the game. That's it. I hope you guys like it. There's so much more to explore and see. Oh, like, oh wait, yeah, look, look. There's some sort of sky whale or something oh, yeah. that flows around that white thing. See it? Yeah. It's in the clouds now, but it, I've never seen it yet, but I know it's there. I saw it, yeah. The only thing Street I wish thing. about this game is that it had fast travel. Mm. That's the only thing it's missing. But other than that, it's amazing. All right. Mm. Bye, everybody. Bye.